Hello guys and welcome to another video. Today I'm going to do another uh, minimalistic project. I'm using this website for the colors. It has some uh, very modern linear gradient uh, colors and you can find them in uh, hex or in RGBA or in whatever you may like. I'm using CodePen. And uh, in the SCSS file, I have defined the three colors that I'm going to use. The main color uh, is the color that I found from the website I saw you before. And inside the class box, I have a position relative, a margin auto, a display block, and some right border that I'm going to comment in the end of our project. So now inside the HTML and inside the class box, I'm going to have all my other classes. The first class is going to be named body and inside the body I'm going also to have a body copy or maybe I uh, can write it as a head and not a body copy. I would like to mention that I will leave all the code in the description box or better I will leave a link to my code pen or in github so you can download the code from wherever you like. Now for the body, I have a position of absolute and then the other important thing is the border bottom left radius which will be 40% and I'm going to do the same for uh, the top left radius and the same for the right part. I'm going to need a top right and a bottom right part. Be careful here that the right part is going to be 50% which is something like a circle whereas the left part is 40%. I'm going to continue with the body copy, but as we mentioned earlier, you can name it uh, like head, it's not a big difference. And the background color I used before was main, and here the main co the color will be also main. The border radius is going to be just 10%, I'm going to have a zent index minus 1, and a transform rotate uh, of 45 degrees. I'm going to continue in the HTML uh, file. I'm going to have a class named I. I will only have one I and it's not a uh, left and right one as I usually have. And then I'm going to end with uh, three parts, part one, part two and part three. I know that uh, the name part isn't very good for a class, but I didn't know how to call it in English as I'm a not native speaker, but you will see what I mean. <laughs> Okay, for the eye the color will be white and I don't think that I'm going to need all this uh, board radius here. I'm just going to need a transform rotate of uh, 35 degrees, I think that's better. Okay, let's keep the, uh, the borders, not a big deal. Right, now I'm going to continue with the parts 1, 2 and 3 and here the background will be a color of main color and this is an RGBA. RGBA, the last property which is A, stands for opacity. So you can change the opacity, it's from 0 until 1. Okay, and now last but not least I'm going to have my part 3. It's something like a tail and here the rotate will be uh, 0 degrees. And now I think uh, we are almost ready, just as an index. Yes, great. Let's uncomment the red border. And that is the final result. I hope you did like it. And uh, I wish you to have a great day.